excitement and anticipation here. A cup final about to be decided. Who will hold the trophy aloft? It's Milan. They take on Inter next on EA TV. Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It's Milan up against Inter. Well, Derek, what a game this should be. Both teams have done really well to get this far, but who will be lifting the cup at the end of the game? I'm sure it'll be a classic, though. This is the Milan starting 11. The goalkeeper is Kiprian Tatarushanu. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And leading the attack today, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Inter's lineup is as follows. Milan Skriniar plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Edin Dzeko starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. Should have talking points aplenty and Inter with the kickoff here. Chalanolu. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. And as a play it goes, throw in coming up here. Mkhitaryan Dzeko well, they might be onto something and still pressing well he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent so what should we expect to see from him in this game Stuart? Defenders Derek hate playing against players with pace and he's got plenty of pace to run in behind he does it cleverly, he comes short then spins in behind and then he's 1v1 against the goalkeeper and he usually finishes it off. Plenty of support here. Ibrahimovic! Oh, a goal here for Milan! They strike first in the final and just listen to their fans! Well, here it is again. What a ball that is over the top of the defence. It's weighted perfectly and the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? Well, underway once again, will Inter be able to articulate an appropriate response? <laughs> Alessandro Bastoni. Di Marco. Dzeko. And return to Mkhitaryan. Martinez. And cleared away. 
the press was on and it worked. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Going short, played into the centre. Well, in fairness, it wasn't the best of headers. Given away by the Rossoneri. Martinez, now with Vicky Tarian. Oh, surely, and fired against the crossbar. Well, here it is again, and all you can do is admire the skill. That's a really clever goal, you have to say. So back underway, following the equaliser. Rafael Leao. And it's Ibrahimovic finding a forward gear. Can he produce? And under pressure, not on the target. Leao. A good-looking ball. Well, the danger is still there. And in the end, no damage done. Dumfries. On the ball, Bastoni. Far from a good pass. Sandro Tonali. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Ball played nicely. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Leal. Ibrahimovic. And he takes on the shot. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Now mopping up defensively. Well, Milan can't believe they're not leading here. But they're certainly creating one or two opportunities now. Might be able to set up the chance. Well, he couldn't keep himself onside. Well, he just delayed the pass, didn't he? That was a great opportunity. Well, Milan have had most of the ball in the last 15 minutes. You sense it's inevitable the goal will come. It will certainly no less than they deserve. They just need to be a bit more clinical in that final third now. And that is going to be a free kick. Alessandro Bastoni really a very poor ball he has teammates around him Ben Asser. Tonali with it Diaz well he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one Jekko, Dumfries, Martinez, he read the situation defensively and did his job, and one minute of stoppage time has been added on, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, 
And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Diaz, the referee correctly decided to play. Ibrahimovic, spectacular save, top class goalkeeping. Barella. Nicely cut out. Ibrahimovic. And Ibrahimovic. Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. Rossoneri pushing forward with options available. Opportunity it is. Well, full credit to him. He had the audacity to try it. Well, that's so close to being a lovely goal. It just doesn't come down in time. The ball with Martinez. And a chance to whip it in here. A very effective clearance. And the textbook interception. Now well, we're into the final half hour. Barella, and with that, the attack fizzles out. Barella, Martinez. And take it away. Superb effort to keep it in. Zlatan Ibrahimovic Ben Asa. Body in the way Mkhitaryan Di Marco Now what can Inter do from this position? Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum and he did now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And deciding to go short with this one. And turned onto the woodwork. Well, this is a really good game of football. Both sides have played well going forward. There's been plenty of chances, goals, and a lot of near misses. It's been great entertainment. And it's offside. That was very close. Lukaku. Oh, great play. Martinez! Oh, a goal! They're in the lead here now.
Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Milan showing good width. This could square the game. Oh, the goal to level it up in the closing stages. Who's going to claim the trophy? It's an open question here. Well, just look at this turn, and the finish isn't bad either. That's a great goal. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. And he read it well defensively. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Teammates available. But timely defending when it mattered. Can he put it in? Oh, a goal! Late drama here! And surely that's one hand on the trophy! So little time left for a response now! Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Brahim. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. And a goal! Just what Milan fans wanted. A late equaliser. Here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. I hope you enjoy high-scoring contests. This has been the game for you. As far as stoppage time is concerned, three minutes here. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes, but this is not over. And two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. Well, the ball rolling again here, the first period of extra time, and you've got to wonder to what extent fatigue will play a part in this now. It's been an extremely competitive 90 minutes. Brahim. Tonali with it. Given away by Milan. 
Lukaku. And continues his run. Unable to keep the ball. Ibrahimovic. It comes to absolutely nothing. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Crossing possibilities. Benasser. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Over the touchline for what will be an inter throw. Varela now with Mkhitaryan oh he's given us away now who can he play it to can he put them in front yes is the emphatic answer and you have to say it was on the cards Let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. So at the halfway stage in extra time, and 15 more minutes left. time continues we're into the second period now and room now out on the wing now disappointing end to the move Dumfries throw in for Milan Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Rafael Leao. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw in. Skriniar. Barella. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Possession given away, unfortunately. Ibrahimovic. Again, look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. Henrik Mkhitaryan 
It's with Robin Gosens. Chance to play it in. Extremely sloppy in possession. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. In behind for him to chase. Well, he stumped it out of there. With... And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.